This is the YAML file we're going to be working with today. The first thing we will have to do is to import FS and JS YAML. Now let's load the YAML data and convert it into JSON. Now, once we have loaded the data, let's take a look at it using console log. And this is the output that we'll get. Let's try and change the value first name to Bob. We can't quite see the results yet because we need to save the file first. So let's do that. And once we run the code, you can see that the first name in our YAML file has changed to Bob. The last thing we'll need to do is to wrap a try catch statement around our code. I linked all of the code, including the YAML file in the description like usual. And remember to check out my other content and leave a like and a comment 